morning. Welcome to Insights. Today we're going to talk about Jesus. He was uh, living in a small town by the Sea of Galilee with his disciples. One day they went to the synagogue to worship. Do you remember what I said a synagogue was? Well, it's kind of like our church, isn't it? After church, they went to Simon and Andrew's house, who were two of his disciples. Do we do that? Sometimes after we have church, do we go to someone's house for a little while, maybe to have lunch? Maybe. Well, they found Simon's mother very ill. She was sick in bed with a fever and everybody was worried. What do you think happened next? The Bible says that Jesus went in to see her and held her hand. All of a sudden, her fever was gone, and she got out of bed, and they all went about having lunch. Well, everybody was so excited, they all went out in the countryside, and they told everybody that they saw that Jesus helped and healed Oh, Simon's mother-in-law. Well, morning came and there was a whole line of people standing outside waiting to be helped by Jesus. But they couldn't find him. They hunted and hunted and finally Simon went out looking for Jesus. And there he was sitting alone on a rock by the sea. And Simon said, what are you doing here? What do you think Jesus was doing? He had been worn out from the day before with all of the healing and uh, teaching and things. And he was tired. So he went out by a quiet place where he could pray to God to give him strength and new power so that he could help some more people. Well, sometimes we get tired and scared too, don't we? We can't always do what God wants us to do, or at least we think we can't. And we need to go someplace quiet and say a prayer. We need to ask God to give us the strength so we can continue to do what he wants us to do. And he will help us all along the way Let's have a short prayer. Dear Lord, thanks for reminding us to know you have much love for each one of us. Help us when we get tired and scared or angry. Thank you for your love that we may be able to give others that love just like Jesus loved us. Well, I hope you folks have a great day. Uh, it's pretty cold out there, so take care. Don't forget your uh, offering pennies. And I have the pictures and everything going on the website for or on the email for you. So have a great day. God bless you all.